Hello everyone, this is Frickle Panda here with a quick review of the Good Day 30 Watt Folding Solar Panel Slash Charger. Uh, this is a solar panel that's 30 watts max. It, it weighs about 2 pounds and this was a real world test in Divide, Colorado at an elevation of 9100 feet, 9100 feet and an outside temperature of 30 five degrees pretty cold as you can see right there so this is an actual trip i really did so on this trip i said it's a perfect time to actually test this before i actually get out into you know if i hike in somewhere or something like that right away pulling out the package well package of course comes from amazon i uh, like i said I, I will leave two links in for amazon for this one that's just the solar panel itself and another one is a combo deal they have where you get the solar panel and a little power bank as well i'll leave both of them for you of course it came it was um well packaged very nice looking, feels very solid. Um, you can see it's got Velcro on it. It has two USB output ports, a USB A and a USB C port, and one DC output port. And so the maximum output power of the USBs and the DC output ports can reach 24 watts for the USB and 30 watts for the DC output port. And as well, this is IP65 waterproof according to the manufacturer. Um, they come with a lifetime warranty according to Amazon. It says they have a lifetime warranty. Um, I like what I like about this is it has enough adapters. You can see all the different adapters it came from for it, but it has the type of adapter to fit my big Blue Eddy 800 watt power bank, as you see me putting right there. Um, and that's the same type of um, uses the same type of DC output port as um, Jackery's too. So the Blue Eddies can they're interchanged. But I use it with my Jackery as well. So this can charge my Blue Eddy as well as any of my Jackery's too, which is really cool. So what I'm gonna do is plugging it in. Um, I'm actually going to end up plugging the Blue Eddy in and charging, helping trickle charge that, and while um, charging, um, I believe it was it was my other power bank because I had been using it a little bit. A little small good day 45,000 mAh uh, power bank or power uh, bank I have as well. So there you see it's plugged in, no problems with it. This is just a test, a simple test of it. We're not going to check the whole efficiency of it at this time. Um, but what I can tell you, it works much better than once. I usually end up with the 10 watt and the 15 watt ones. And honestly, I think the 10 watts and the 15 watt ones are not, I think they're just way too small to be useful, to be honest with you. Versus this is 30 watts. I could definitely see taking this on a road trip, or excuse me, on a hike in. As you can see, that was the good day 45,000 mAh power bank I'm going to test it with as well. I'll leave a link in the description for that one too. But it's saying I like the size of it. It's not too big. Under it's around two pounds. According to them, it felt lighter than two pounds. But what do I know? What I do know is this is the type I would take if I was going on an extended like backpacking trip where I'm going to be hiking in. I'm not going to lug a big solar panel, but a 30 watt I think is a perfect size, especially with a few power banks in your phone to keep everything fully charged and get a decent, decent uh, charge from the sun without it being too big or too small. So yeah, I really do like that about this one. And I misspoke, spoke. it's IP65 water resistant, not waterproof, so IP65 water resistant. Also, you do not see in this, well, maybe you could have seen it. There's two carabiners that come with it, so for the little holes in it, you can actually um, hook this up to your bag when you got it folded up and have it on the back of your backpack and stuff like that, so you can carry it that way as well. I like how it's built. I think it's very efficient. It's 24% efficient, but the size of it, I think, is a very important thing for me, especially when I'm not doing a heavy, heavy trip. Um, like, like I'm not I'm taking my truck or something. I'm actually just backpacking it. Anyway, I hope this um, helps some people out there that are interested in this 30-watt panel. I think it's just the right size, especially for hiking into places. Anyway, this is Frugal Panda. Thanks for watching. This is a good day 30-watt solar panel.